If you or your child has head lice, your doctor may prescribe malathion lotion to treat the infestation. Head lice are small insects that can cause irritation and discomfort on the scalp. Malathion is part of a group of medications called organophosphates, and it works by paralyzing and killing the lice and their eggs. It's important to note that this medication is not suitable for use in newborns or infants younger than one year old. It's typically applied to the hair and left on for a specific amount of time before being washed out. Your doctor will provide you with the correct dosage and instructions for using malathion lotion effectively. Remember to follow these instructions carefully for the best results. Make sure to carefully read and follow all the instructions in the product package. This medication is specifically for use on the hair and scalp, so be sure to avoid swallowing it and keep it away from your nose, ears, mouth, vagina, and eyes. If it does accidentally get in your eyes, flush them with water and speak to your doctor if you experience any irritation or vision changes. To use the medication, apply it to dry hair and scalp, making sure to saturate the hair and scalp, especially the back of the head and neck. Leave the medication on for 8 to 12 hours, then shampoo and rinse well. After that, use a fine-toothed comb to remove any dead lice and lice eggs from your wet hair. It's important to note that this medication may cause a slight stinging feeling on the scalp, but if you experience any skin irritation, wash the scalp and hair right away. Also, be cautious because this medication is flammable, so avoid being around open flames or electric heat sources while using it. If lice are still present after 7 to 9 days, consult your doctor as you may need to repeat the treatment with this medication or try a different one. And remember to wash your hands after applying the medication and be sure to follow the instructions for knit removal in the product package. Some common side effects of malathion lotion may include burning, stinging, dry hair, or a temporary increase in dandruff. If any of these effects persist or worsen, it's important to consult your doctor or pharmacist. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed to you because your doctor has determined that the benefits outweigh the potential risks of side effects. Most people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. While it's rare, a very serious allergic reaction to this drug can occur. Seek medical help immediately if you experience symptoms such as rash, itching slash swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. This is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects, it's important to contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you are in the U.S., you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects or report them to the FDA. In Canada, you can contact your doctor for advice or report side effects to Health Canada. Before using malathion lotion, it's important to talk to your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies. This medication may contain ingredients that can cause allergic reactions. It's also important to discuss your medical history, especially if you have asthma, skin infections, psoriasis, eczema, or any open sores or wounds on the scalp. If you experience constant or forceful scratching of the scalp, it could lead to a bacterial skin infection. If you notice worsening redness or pus, be sure to contact your doctor right away. If you're pregnant, only use malathion lotion if it's clearly needed and discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. If you are applying this medication on someone else while pregnant, handle it with care. It's unclear if this drug passes into breast milk, so consult your doctor before breastfeeding. Now, when it comes to using malathion lotion, it's important to be aware of any potential drug interactions. This means that using malathion lotion alongside certain medications could affect how well they work, or even increase your risk of experiencing serious side effects. It's crucial to keep a list of all the products you use, including both prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as any herbal products, and share this information with your doctor and pharmacist. It's important to note that you should never start, stop, or change the dosage of any medication without first consulting with your doctor. This will ensure that you are using malathion lotion safely and effectively. If this medication is accidentally ingested, it can be harmful. If someone has taken too much and is experiencing severe symptoms such as fainting or difficulty breathing, it is important to call emergency services immediately. Otherwise, contact the Poison Control Center for assistance. Symptoms of an overdose may include breathing difficulties, muscle weakness or paralysis, tremors, excessive sweating, saliva or tears, increased urination, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, 
anxiety, headache, confusion, dizziness, drowsiness, and irregular heartbeat. When using Malathion lotion, it's important not to share this medication unless directed by your doctor. Usually, just one application is needed. To prevent spreading lice to others or reinfesting yourself, make sure to wash all headwear, scarves, coats, and bed linens in hot water and dry them on high heat for at least 20 minutes. You can also dry clean them, seal them in a plastic bag for two weeks, or use a disinfectant spray that kills lice. Additionally, soak brushes and combs in hot water for 10 minutes, alcohol for one hour, or throw them away. Vacuum furniture and floors thoroughly. If you're in close contact with someone who has lice, such as household members, it's important to check for lice and nits. Even if live lice are not found, treatment may be considered to prevent infestation. Malathion lotion is used to treat head lice, which are tiny insects that infest the hair and scalp. This medication works by paralyzing and killing the lice and their eggs. It is important to follow the instructions for proper use of this medication to ensure it is effective. Typically, malathion lotion is applied to the hair and scalp and left on for a certain amount of time before being rinsed out. It is important to use a fine-tooth comb to remove any remaining lice and eggs after treatment. The frequency and duration of treatment may vary depending on the severity of the infestation. Be sure to consult with a healthcare professional for the best timing and dosage for your specific situation. When storing malathion lotion, make sure to keep it at room temperature and away from open flames. It's important to store all medications out of reach of children and pets. When it comes to disposing of the product, do not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless advised. Instead, properly discard the lotion when it is expired or no longer needed. If you're unsure about how to dispose of it, consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.